Hey guys, how are we today? So I got something really cool to show you guys. Um, I was trying to figure out a way to get a temperature reading, but unless you want to do it through software or maybe your case has a built-in sensor, something like that, but I don't have nothing like that. So what I did is I went on Amazon and I found this. It's a little LCD and thermostat. It's the uh, Linux LCD temp reader for your PC water cooling. It has a G1 fourth uh, thread at the end of it. So I'm going to open it up and talk a little about it and see how it goes from there. Cool. Alright. So this is what the package came in. Just a little anti-static box or bag, whatever you want to call it. So then you have, what is this, a little acrylic Oh, okay, I get it. It's a, uh, oh, that's nice. A lot of the kits don't come with that. See that? It's a little acrylic base for it. That's pretty cool. It's a little acrylic base. All right, then we got, let's see here. We have the actual sensor or LCD. No, this is the LCD screen itself. So it just goes like that, and then it runs to a standard Molex which is pretty cool because it has a both male and female connection so you can run it either way and then the actual sensor is right here it's on a uh, what is it a standard G14 thread and it has some kind of uh, silicone on it I guess that's to make sure it's waterproof that's basically what this is meant for is to check the temperatures of your waterproof stuff so I'm not going to do that. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take it and route it through the case and lay the sensor on the back side. Well, let's see here, where the behind the RAM and where the heat sink is. So that way I can get the best temperature reading and try to get a display for it. So we're going to see what it looks like once I get it all hooked up. All right, so I got it hooked up and it's runs right over in the back so it's coming through the back side there and then the sensor is laying right there behind the block and the RAM sticks so it's sitting right on where the CPU and the heat sink for the the cooler meets so as you can see I got it turned on right now and it is in Celsius that's the only thing I don't like is that it's in Celsius I don't know if it's maybe a few degrees off or not it may be um, I really like the acrylic base I mean I put it inside my case so all I gotta do is flip over and boom look at it it was super easy to install guys I mean it took it took no time to install it it was like five seconds it was probably the best $10 I've ever spent, and it does exactly what I want, and I highly, highly recommend it. So, but that's my video. Thank you for watching, and subscribe, and as always, y'all be cool. Bye.